Hej, välkommen tillbaka till vår Youtube-kanal. Idag ska vi åka till Stockholm i Sverige. Jag kommer inte prata svenska i den här videon, men jag vill göra en svensk introduktion. Välkomna att umgås med oss! Hey guys, as you have seen, I did introduction in Swedish language because I'm going to Ivana to Stockholm. Yes, <laughs> we are going to the capital of Sweden. Uh, we are very exciting because we haven't flight since two years. <laughs> yes, it passed a lot of times. A lot, a lot, and we were like we had first time in the airport <laughs> yes. with the boarding control, yes. passport control. Now, now it's a little weird. Uh, feelings now, yeah, it's still some, some, that doesn't matter. We are waiting for our departure, yes. How many times do we have? About two hours? Yes, about two, about two hours. Seven so. and ten is departure. Yes, PM. yes seven, mm, seven in the evening, and we should be in Stockholm about nine. Mm -hmm. Our flight will take us three hours. Yes, nine their time here will be about ten. Yes, it's different time uh, in Sweden because it's one hour uh, back. <laughs> yes, more early. It's more early there, so it will be changed little time. It's like in Poland. It's <laughs> like in Poland. Yes, so we are awaiting for our departure, and we will talk to you in Sweden. Welcome to Sverige. What it means? Welcome in Sweden. We arrived yesterday evening and our flight took us two hours and a half. So it was shorter than we were expected. And when we were in the airport, we took a bus and this was the best option to go to the center here to Stockholm because uh, that was far away, about 60 not 60, 89 kilometers, so uh, long distance and we bought the tickets um, in Bucharest. I placed the order um, for the tickets online because it was the best option uh, to choose and I paid for both of us for two tickets, 400 crowns because this is the uh, currency in Sweden, they don't have euro or uh, they have just own currency, what is the name Corona, it means crowns, and uh, here I will write you the prices where you, when we will be in some shopping, uh, when we pay for something, but in general if we can count this uh, price of the tickets for lei, it's Romanian lei, it's uh, about 180 lei for both of us. And uh, we took this bus to the center, as I mentioned. Mm, we were very tired after the trip, so I didn't record nothing yesterday evening. We, we went to the hotel. Uh, from the bus, from the station, we had not long way, because it was about one and a half kilometers, so it was pretty good to walk little after <laughs> all this trip when we had to sit first in the plane, after that in the bus, so the walking made us good. And now we are resting, we rested and uh, we want to go to eat the breakfast. And after breakfast, of course, we are going to explore the city of Stockholm. And I want to tell you about hotel. The name of this hotel is Ibis. Don't ask me about the price, <laughs> because the prices in Sweden are really high. And here in the meantime, when I'm talking a little about this uh, hotel, you will see how it looks, our room, bathroom, etc. Uh, what else I want to say? Uh, Anna, how do you feel today? <laughs> Hello, good morning. Now we are rest and we want to go to eat the breakfast because we are a little hungry. 
And I want to say about this Ibis style hotel, it's uh, not only here in Sweden, uh, it's in Romania also, in Poland, and uh, it's like, I don't know, a international, international yes, brand of, uh, of hotels. And uh, we are very happy we choose this. We are close to center, about one and a half kilometer, we'll go by walk. And we will go now to eat the breakfast and we will show you. Stay with us! Finally, we are going to walk in and to admire the beauty of Stockholm. We want to go to Gamlastan, the most popular place in this city. And I'm very lucky because I understand little Swedish language. I'm studying Swedish and I'm able to understand some simple sentences what the people are saying and I'm not like in the fog <laughs> when I'm here. I can recognize what is right somewhere. Well, I don't know, some basic things, you know. So it's good opportunity to me also to practice this language. And I'm happy to be here. And what is your opinion, Anna? I like very much this city, how I saw in the night and now in the day. It impressed me how much modern it is. And I don't know, I never saw something like this <laughs> before in positive way. This Nordic style, the houses, architecture is very nice and I'm happy. It's very nice weather because I was thinking it's cold, we are going in north, so <laughs> here is all the time cold. Yes, in this sun we are catching vitamin D, mm -hmm. so we are enjoying beautiful weather and we are uh, walking. We yes. have to burn calories from breakfast. Yes, because many people uh, are living with the stereotypes, how uh, you know about also Romania, yes? And the same is about Sweden, because they think ah Sweden is the cold country oh, and <laughs> all the time it's cold. But here is only the winter. Now no? it's 13 March and it's about I don't know six eight degree, but it's feel it's feel very nice. Of course we are uh, we were ready with the winter clothes, but I'm happy. I mm -hmm. don't have to wear them so much and I don't know I'm happy of this sun. Yes, but I was right. prepared to take me my sunglasses. Yes, <laughs> even I can say we have better weather than it was in Bucharest before we yes, yes, indeed. came indeed. Bucharest was <laughs> snowing <laughs> yes, and wind. Okay, so we are going I to... I like very much and I am from the first uh, hours in Stockholm, also in the night and now I can tell you it's very beautiful here and it's worth to come. Okay, we are going to come last time. Yes. Ibrahimovic, the most famous football player in Sweden. Swedish flags. Anna is looking for, of course, <laughs> some souvenirs. It's shining my eyes. <laughs> Here is some place where you can drink orange juice. I catch the lion. <laughs> and here you can see the guard. I have to tell you that Stockholm really impressed me. It's wonderful city, beautiful. I was many years in, ago in Sweden, it was in 2004, but I have seen only the part of Sweden where it was the nature, <laughs> amazing countryside. And I just passed, I just passed through the Stockholm and I had an opportunity to see this beautiful city. Now I'm very happy. And I'm glad to see this place because I haven't seen this before.
ferry boat we passed the street there in the distance you can see national museum hello you bitule hey <laughs> how, hey, do hey. You, how do you feel in sweden i feel very good because i wanted to go here so much it yes my, i want to ask dream. you <laughs> why you want so much to come back in sweden <laughs> yes uh, as i mentioned before because i told uh, i was speaking along with the camera when you were watching something and i told i was in sweden in 2004 so it was many many years ago and i didn't show sweden how and it looks what look, is the region how, you come there how it looks <laughs> here in, in stockholm yes in this city because i only passed through the stockholm and i was in some countryside in some village but yes it, it was in the year when the poland uh, joined to the european union yes and uh, I came to Sweden. You could travel only with ID. Yes, yes, but it wasn't matter. Yes, uh, I came here only to work. <laughs> yes, so I was working in holiday in Sweden. It was many years ago, mm -hmm. and I hadn't so much opportunity to, to visit Stockholm or some other beautiful places in Sweden. I have seen some other little cities. As for example, Uppsala, Sala, the, these cities are more on the north of the Sweden, about 200, 300 kilometers away from here. So yes, that was my story. I could tell a lot of about this. I met uh, very good people here in Sweden, and even I was thinking to meet with some friend who is living there, uh, more on the north, but. He's old man and uh, it's too difficult now to go to visit It's too him. far because we are only three days and yes, yes, we want to far. enjoy to, mm -hmm. to visit as much as possible here. Yes, that's right. And, and you are happy, your dream come true and uh, yes, you come of, back. Yes, of course, I'm very happy because uh, as I told, I, I love Sweden as <laughs> <laughs> the country. It was some important part in my life when I was here and I wanted to come back to, to, to visit again to see something more especially Stockholm because I have never seen it before and so I'm enjoying with you and I'm glad uh, that you could come with me yes you <laughs> my wife <laughs> you are with me here so yes and tell me wha what is the region also we came here in this period ah, yes. March. Of, of course uh, 12 March we came 12 March and in this day uh, we get known <laughs> together. And we yes. celebrate our anniversary. <laughs> yes, it's our anniversary because we started our um, relations from, <laughs> from from the Instagram and since this day, since 12 March 2018, um, we started to talk each other. Yes, so that was also our story and this is special day, special anniversary because we are here yes, okay. in Sweden. Thank you very much for the interview. Let's <laughs> yes. keep going. Thank you. Tak <laughs> samo. Take a break. What is in the Swedish language is called fika. Yes. Oh, be careful. <laughs> <laughs> what it means fika? It means a break for coffee, eat a sweet roll with cinnamon and enjoy the day. Yes, exactly. You know so good. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> husband explained it. <laughs> yes. It means I'm little smart. <laughs> <laughs> More than little. Okay. And what uh, what the next? What we have planned? I booked a free guide tour, of course we let some tip uh, and it's a tour uh, by walking and we'll see the Stockholm by walking Okay, I can't wait, but okay. we have one hour to, to go there so Yes, about one hour, at about 1 pm is mm -hmm. the tour mm -hmm. It's um, two hours to go until mm -hmm. 3 But if we'll be boring or we want to go somewhere else, we mm -hmm. must not stay until 
then. Now we want to go in this place where is wrote in uh, our book where mm -hmm. we are meeting mm -hmm. with the guides. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. So we are yes, going and there. And this guide is not in Romanian, it's in English. <laughs> 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 I have to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> yes. But however, we are speaking English, uh, so we should yes. be understandable for our fo followers. Sure. I will do Polish subtitles since sometimes we are not doing Romanian because yes. we just stopped. <laughs> <laughs> What we have here, show, show to the camera. Look, we have cinnamon roll. It, you can see? Yes, I see. Cinnamon roll and some brioche. Brioche, I will tell you in Romanian, with chocolate chips. Mm. Ah, the zaibiste is not Cinnamon and apple. Ah. It's taste of Sweden. Yes, and I have chai latte and my baby has mocha. Mo macchiato. Mo ah, macchiato. Okay. Macchiato. Is it good? Mm. Delicious. Enjoy. Let's preparing for tour. <laughs> Let's preparing for tour. Yes, we are here and we are waiting the tour to come. There is our wait. There is our guide behind yes. us here, yes? Yes, it's from Croatia. And that is linked to Gustav III. The third basically opened up the building 150 years after he died. So it was 1782. And seven years later, he did regret that decision because the French organized a very lovely party. It wasn't really a party, it was a revolution. And that meant goodbye, kings and queens. The same approach was taken in Sweden. The nobility tried killing the kings and they did not succeed. Three years they tried, three years they would fail. compare the shoes we have. <laughs> 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 Enough pictures. <laughs> no, never enough. How do you, do you like our trip? <laughs> Great trip. <laughs> Come on, something. Informative. A lot of information. Yes, that's right. It is very funny, it's not boring. <laughs> we recommend. We let's link below yes, the video. Yes, the book. The Notice everything. <laughs> <laughs> We are in 
the restaurant. I had here, of course, school. Ah, delicious, delicious Swedish beer. I have to tell you, this guide tour was really interesting, and I recommend to everyone if you will have opportunity to be in Stockholm, you should try this guy <laughs> who did us <coughs> the trip around the Gamla Stan. It was really, really great, very informative, very good experience for us. How it was our tour? Uh, it was very interesting. As you saw, I had the smile on my face all over the, the time when it was the tour and uh, it was my first, our first tour and I have to tell you, it was really nice, informative, not boring and uh, we found a lot of uh, nice things about children, even that they have fake windows <laughs> they paint the windows to look rich because it's some tax in it was in the past i don't know if it's now it's the tax for the window you have to pay for, uh, as you have more windows you have to pay more so this uh, uh, who want to look like rich they painted their windows this was interesting I, it was something that i, I yes. didn't know about sweden yes it was a lot of very interesting stories yes. also about uh, this little monument with the boy Yes, no, yes. and our guide told nobody should touch him and yes. and don't kiss even because it was happened with some body who was some sightseeing. Tourists. Yes, mm -hmm. some tourists they they, they were, were touching and they were kissing him. And what was the story? But, uh, the cats and the dogs they are uh, pissing them. Yes, <laughs> so it's better to not do this. In the meantime, when you're yes. talking about this, I will show you the, the, the shot. Yes, from, from and the this. people are letting the, the coins, the money, and uh, in the end of the day, the homeless or the poor people, they are collecting this money. So you are, if you, are, you want to choose to let some coin there, you are helping the poor people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, that's total. right. We are waiting for our order. Yes, yes, yes. Very hungry. We receive our meals. Here is meatballs with potato, some sauce and little salads. And here I have tomato soup, cream soup with little bread. The food was really good, but I have to tell you that the prices in Stockholm Basically, in Sweden, it's pretty high <laughs> for the people from Eastern Europe as we are. Yes, that's my conclusion. But okay, the food was really good. We we tried traditional Swedish meatballs and the beer. Swedish beer was also good. And now we are going to some nice place. What is the name? Strand Vegan, and there is the nice area to walk around to the water. I want to show you something. Here is charging the car. In this time where <laughs> the fuel is so expensive, this is some solution. Tesla. Tesla is popular probably in Sweden. The Swedish people like electric cars. And they have some benefits when they have electric cars in Stockholm. Probably they have they are allowed to parking for free in Gamla Stan. Now we are in the area of the Strandwagen. Beautiful place, a lot of ferry boats, as you can see. Anna is taking the pictures. We are in the area of Strandwagen. A lot of ferry boats there are here. Yes. Beautiful, beautiful area. Beautiful like area, it. yes, we are. I feel a little like in Istanbul, <laughs> in Bosphor. <laughs> yes, like in Bosphor. Yes. Yes. I remember how you were. Yes, it was nice, it's very well. Yes. Two years ago, just two years ago yes. since we didn't fly with the airplane. Yes, that's and right. Now it's because it was our this, moment. It was this crazy period when we couldn't travel by plane. And now it has been finished, I hope, <laughs> for this moment. And what else? We are walking yes, along the yes, along the coast. <laughs> It's 
almost 6 in the evening and we are going to the hotel because we feel in our legs the tired Anna, it hurts your <laughs> legs? <laughs> Anna tells she's tired also yes, and it's getting to be dark so I think it's finished our sightseeing in this day we want to take a rest and have the strong tomorrow and visit other places I don't know we will do some plan what to see in Stockholm I want to say if you like this video of course give us thumbs up let some comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel hey though